Massimo Zanetti, a businessman who understands the importance of giving back to those who are less fortunate. He established the Massimo Zanetti Beverage Group with yearly revenue of over $1 billion. The group owns more than 25 brands and employs more than 4,000 people across four continents. During his travels, Massimo Zanetti discovered that within these impoverished nations where coffee is grown and harvested, there exists a distinct need for the children and the families that live and work there. Inspired to give back, he and his children established the Zanetti Foundation, a global nonprofit organization with child welfare as its primary focus. The Foundation's initiatives provide food, shelter, education, and health care to children and families challenged by poverty, disease, and global strife. One of his most recent projects, the building of a school in Honduras, offers education to the children of those who live and work in this impoverished nation. The House of Smiles in Rwanda provides health insurance, meals, and professional training to single mothers and their children. In Ukraine, children are provided physiotherapy, services available to them at the National Institute for Cancer Care in Kiev. And in Brazil, the Espaco Casa Viva provides arts, music, and computer courses to over 300 youth exposed to street violence, drugs, and exploitation. The foundation allowed Mr. Zanetti to honor his promise to Formula One legend Ekrian Senna to come to the aid of street children in Brazil. Inside our coffee plantation in Brazil, there's a clinic with a doctor on call and an ambulance. The foundation's global outreach includes ongoing programs in Romania, Somalia, Togo, Haiti, Tanzania, and many other nations, and through partnerships with other organizations that share his passion for the well-being of children, the Zanetti Foundation continues to grow. Massimo Zanetti understands that with great success comes the responsibility of giving back, caring for your fellow man, and making the world a better place for future generations.